Welcome back everyone, this is Superstar Brother playing Super Mario RPG Legend of the Seven Stars. Okay, if you want to... We just ran down the Midas course, Midas River course, gathering coins. If you want to go back and grab some more coins, you can jump onto this spring here. But I think we'll just move on. I can do that on my own time. You know, you don't think you want to watch me do that all over, over and over and over. Okay, we're just going to move on to Tadpole Pond. Okay, if you come over here, this is where they sell stuff for green frog coins, but they're not there. Okay, never mind. We're just going to stand right here. Hi, can I help you? Mello, it's you. We've heard all about your adventures with Super Mario. Really? We've only, we haven't been much. You guys beat up the loom, right? You know about that? See, Mario, the waterways of the world bring news to us here. That's why Grandpa knows all the news that's fit to hear. Are you really the Super Mario? Hey, everybody! You'll never guess who's here! He's the real thing, but he doesn't look anything like I thought he would. <laughs> they do say he can jump better than a froggy. I wonder if it's only a rumor. Hey, no, it's not. <laughs> Woo -hoo -hoo! <laughs> well, Grasshopper, what's new? Grandpa, Mario's been helping me. I know, child. That rainstorm you just had, that was you, wasn't it? Wait, whoa. <laughs> Ouch. Watch it up there. You're supposed to be. make me look like I'm floating here, okay? Wow. He's floating. And I totally don't notice that line. Welcome. So, you are the Mario, yes? I am proud of you. Okay, this... Hmm. Welcome. <coughs> ah. I am Frog Fuchsius. You have come to seek wisdom from me, have you not? I've been waiting for you. Yes, old wise people can often give good advice. There we go, I got his voice. <laughs> but how rude of me. Let's get more comfortable. Come along and we'll talk. Clear, full reverse. Tadpoles, don't just float there. Make yourselves useful. Form a bridge for Mario. All right. Okay. Just press forward as you and just press A as you're hopping across, so, so that you do hop across. Yes, come into my sanctuary and partake of my wisdom, children. Let's see, that smithy character that appeared at Bowser's Keep. He is quite formidable, yes? And Mario, you wish to rescue the princess quickly, do you not? But oh, if only you knew the truth! Toadstool is no longer there! She's what? Patience, young one. Let me explain. Here is what happened. You were rescuing Toadstool from Bowser's Keep. After defeating him, and just when you were about to free the princess, you heard a loud crash and saw a huge sword split the sky. Wow. Whoosh! Out of the blue! The shock sent the three of you flying. Bowser and Toadstool are still lost somewhere out there. Now, you're worried about the princess, but first you need to take care of Smithy. First? His underlings are wreaking havoc in our world. Mac, whom you defeated at Mushroom Kingdom, was one of them. More will be coming. More? Grandpa, I almost forgot to tell you something. We found a star in the castle at Mushroom Kingdom. Do you know why it was there? A star, eh? Most interesting. This may sound illogical, but I believe shooting stars can grant wishes. And now more than ever, I believe they will play a vital role in the fight against Smithy. Was that too much to absorb? Would you like a recap? Nope. 
It's quite a situation we have in our hands, isn't it? Wow, everything sounds so dire and serious. I guess Mac was only the first of many, Mario. Some of them will make Bowser seem nice. <laughs> Malo, you speak as if these things do not concern you. You will accompany Mario on his adventure, too. <gasps> Grandpa, what are you talking about? I'm only a simple tadpole. This adventure isn't for me. Malo, my boy, I've kept this from you until now. But you're... Not a tadpole. Shocking! Say what? <laughs> what a turn of events. I was sitting here one rainy day, enjoying a snack of crickets, when I happened to see a basket floating down from the falls. I peeked inside and saw a little baby staring right back at me. The name Mallow was written on his belt. I felt sorry for the little bundle of puff and took a man to raise as my own grandchild. He had powerful magic, and I knew he was more than a piece of fluff. I thought, surely this child must be from some far-off land. Grandpa, you mean I'm not... a tadpole? Yeah, he's not a tadpole. <laughs> no! Now is not the time to cry! Go with Mario on his adventure and find your real family. Your real mother and father are out there somewhere. Psst, Mario. The boy's magic is sure to come in handy on your adventure. You'll take him along, yes? Grandpa! I won't cry anymore. I'll go on this adventure with Mario and find my real family. Then it is settled. You must embark on your adventure immediately. First, go to Rose Town, where they need your help. Oh, but before we leave, I'm gonna go talk to Frog Fuchsia. He looks a little sad. <laughs> it will be quiet around here with Milo gone. Maybe a snack will cheer me up. That's right! I had forgotten all about it! I will give you something for the cricket pie you brought back. Ah, I know! You shall have the stuff I used when I was Mallow's age. The froggy stick will come in handy. Do not forget to equip it. Alright, this is a weapon for Mallow. Ugh, bother. Okay, we're gonna have to hop across here, and then we can use it! Alright, let's see, equip. Oh, come on! Equip! Thank you! Froggy stick, weapon for Mallow. This should increase his uh, offensive power significantly. Melody Bay. Play notes by jumping on the tadpoles. Let's hear your melody. Okay, there's a certain song that... Todovsky right here. This is Todovsky. I am the composer Todovsky. I am trying to create my next masterpiece, but I've got composer's block. You want a music lesson from moi? Sure, why not? Let's start by reading notes. See the five lines? Between the second and third lines from the top lies Do. Okay. I think I can see that. So, okay, the second gap. Keep going up and the notes are Do, Re, Mi. Go down and you'll get t Do, Ti, La, So, Fa. Do, Re, Mi. Okay, Do, Re, Mi. No. Do re mi. D T la so fa. Okay, say that again. Sure, let's see. Okay, see the five lines between the second and third lines? That's do. Do re mi. Do re mi goes up. Mi. Do T la so fa. Okay, let's see if I can remember that. So this is Do right there. Okay, Do Re Mi going up. Do Ti La So Fa, I think. Okay, this guy, uh, somebody will tell you what his favorite song is. 
I've got this dream of becoming a composer. I want to be as famous as Todovsky. My favorite song? It's from Fuchsia's Sweet, number 18. So la miri do ri do ri. Todovsky's fond of it too. Okay, hold on. So re. Wait. What was that again? Ah, uh, come on. So la mi re do re do re. So la mi. Re do re do. Re. <laughs> so la mi. Okay. And now I'm gonna have to remember which one's so re me. So. So re me. Okay. Do li. So re me. Do re. Oh bother. That little nuts. Do re me. I think it was ah crap, I think I did it wrong. Is that something you composed? No, that's not the right. I didn't think so. Okay, hold on. All right, that should work. Ow, oh, crap. Okay. Mm. Armed with my piece of paper, I am going to create music. Okay, hold on. So. Oh, they're nuisances. Oh, for the love of Pete. Okay. Oh, come on. Oh, come for the sake of. Oh crap, I messed up. Uh. Uh, okay, hold on. Alright, with that failed attempt to create music, this is Superstar Brother to be continued.